Hey everybody, this is Andrew How How It Works. Today I'm going to be showing you how to um, make the modified bootcamp file work. Uh, long story short, um, whenever you are using it and downloading it from another source, um, Mac OS will tell you that it is that it is damaged, which is partly the reason why you guys are here watching this video. So <clears throat> I'm going to show you what I mean. You're going to click on Bootcamp Assistant. Bootcamp Assistant modified is damaged and cannot be opened. Well, that, let me tell you, that is a load of baloney. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to hit Cancel. We're going to go to System Preferences, and if you can't find it, click on the launch pad. Go to System Preferences. Boom. And now the very top um, column here. You're going to then go to security and privacy. You're going to then click on the lock. You're going to then put in your password. And then you're going to select anywhere, allow from anywhere. And then boom. We're at this point where you can just close out of it. You can literally drag it right to your applications folder. You're going to then launch it. And then, as you can see here, it's going to be in your Applications folder. You can now drag it, and then boom, open. Remember, this bootcamp file will not work on any other Mac OS other than El Capitan. <clears throat> Again, only on El Capitan. The reason why is because it's originally made from El Capitan so that's the reason why so if you have to make that bootable El Capitan before you do anything alright good luck guys bye